doing now, he's taking the best of those last two years, getting rid of the worst of those last two years. We're going to put more on top of it, and it's time to take off. It's a great opportunity in front of you. We, 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 we could definitely be one of the 12. Now, you know what's so funny when I was driving here, I was I thinking about my family. You guys ever, you know, I'm a Floridian, I'm from here. So, every time hurricanes and everything come, you hear it. They come on the news, and they start saying, you gotta prepare for this storm. We gotta hunker down. Hunker down. Now, now. <laughs> I called my brother now when I'm in Dallas and a storm is coming. I said, man, you got to get some plane tickets. You guys are down. We ain't giving up for nobody. We are. First of all, I don't even know what hunkering down means. Where did we get it from? Hunker down. This is a hurricane category for you hunkering all you want to. But here's your house, you in trouble. And I was the kid, right? I got, I, I got the scotch tape. Put the X on the window. Like that's really gonna do so. If that storm hits, you know what I'm saying? You, you know, you know that's not going to really do anything if that storm's hit. But when coach is talking about everybody doesn't pull for you. They don't pull for Miami because of the way we did it and the way we will do it again. We do it our way. Coach is right. You guys want to be champions. It don't start on Saturday. And it doesn't start when the season starts. It starts with the storm raging in you. I had somebody this year try to get on social media and tell me, Michael, you know, we haven't seen you in Miami, that means you're not really a hurricane. I said, stop. Dude, a lot of things I'll take on social media. But that I will not take. You joking? Y'all much blood and sweat I left on this field? You can't take it away with your words. The ghost lives out here. I left them out here. I worked my storm out of me. My storm came from the living in the ghettos of Fort Lauderdale. I worked that storm out. You got to work that storm out. And you got to hunker down together as a team. You got to hold each other accountable. And I'm not talking about worrying about the game on Saturday. Hold each other accountable. I'm here every damn day. Saturday will take care of itself. Saturday is not what you worry about. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, right here. Saturday will take care of itself. And it's top to bottom. It's top to bottom. You know, old days we used to have a game around here. It was called a toilet bowl. It's too The toilet bowl. You know what the toilet bowl was? A lot of the guys are shaking their heads. You know why? Because they remember that toilet. Toilet bowl with everybody that didn't play in the game on Saturday, we get the scrimmage on one of them. And dude, we were busting ass out going up against each other. Because we were trying to show the guys that did play on Saturday that we will earn the right to get in that fight with you on Saturday. We had to earn it out here. It's something that but nobody out here watching us, it was just us. And it was some of the toughest ass games we've ever played in. I guarantee you, you'd rather see Oklahoma or Rutgers or anybody else than to line your ass up in this toilet bowl. But that's what you gotta get back to. You gotta get back to these practices. Being the fucking toilet Excuse my language. But if yeah, they you did. get back to these being the toilet bowl, you can play in Super Bowl or whatever championship they got out here. But it, it starts out here.
toilet bowl MVP. <laughs> it starts out here. We have the talent. Have you seen Jaya? We have the talent. Coach and his staff has done a wonderful job recruiting. You got the skill. We got the guys that run fast. We got the guys that catch. We got the guys that do all of that. We have the skill. But we must have a collective will. That's what wins championships. That's what wins championships. You see, skill is going to be about this much. Will is going to be about this much. And all of our wills together, nobody can break that. And you got to form that bond right here every day with how you practice. I pull people off. Rohan, let's go, Rohan. I say, let's go. After practice, we walk in and say, hey, where you, where you going? Get your butt back out here, let's go. You have to take this. You know, we, 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 we came back out here, we practiced. Guys went to the league, they came back here in practice. Because we want to pass that on. We're in an Instagram world. Instagram, where everybody's social media. In the Instagram world, the one thing that will never be instant is this game. There's too many of us. And it takes everybody in this game to have success on any one play. There is no such thing as the individual isolated success. So when you line up, you're only as good as the man next to you. Yeah. That's why the work has to be put in out here together. You can be the greatest wide receiver in the world. If they're not blocking for the quarterback, you don't get a chance to show the world. You can be the greatest running back. If we don't have the right alignment blocking for you, you don't get a chance to show the world. So getting yourself right don't do nothing. And that's improper grammar. It's a double negative. Don't do nothing. I should say don't do anything, but I want to emphasize it's not just about you. So I gave you the double negative. Don't do nothing. You got to get your ass out here, and you got to look around, and you got to hold everybody that you know accountable to get their ass out here and put in the work. That's it. I got that. You have to get to the place where the only way you can be my friend is if you can help me win. Period. I don't care. That's it. That's us. And we have an opportunity. We can be in these 12. We're going to shake the world. This group in here right now, man, people have been waiting Miami. And we bubbled towards the top a few times, moved up the rankings a few times. You see all the crowds start coming back. You're like, wow, this is kind of over. Okay. But this has to be the year we break through. We break through. Coach Cristobal's third year, we break through. First two we needed to dig down. Now we go up. Kevin Hester had just talked about, he was talking about, he was saying, it's the work you do in the dark, not what people see in the light. You ride around Miami, you see these great beautiful trees. And you don't want to see a tree when it breaks ground and it starts growing up towards that beautiful light we call the sun. But the reality is, before that tree breaks ground and starts growing up towards the light, it has done so much work underground, digging down in the roots. Out here is about to dig it damn down in the roots to solidify our base 
For whatever storm comes against us, we will stand tall and hunker down and win. You understand what I'm saying? No one can give it to you. No matter how much everybody